Hello guys and welcome back to the Solopreneur channel. My name is Shannon and I'm your host and today we are going to talk about my goal list. So this is just me reacting to my goal list of all the things that I wrote down in 2019 that I was hoping to happen in 2020. I followed Steve Harvey's um, goal list and I'll drop that video down below. So basically in that video Steve Harvey encouraged you to write more than 300 things on your list, manifest it, pray about it, and then scratch things off as everything comes true on your list. So th some things have already come true on here, um, like clients in 2020, like I had started a tutoring business at the beginning of the year before COVID had messed everything up. Um, I wouldn't say it messed everything up. Um, I could have transitioned them online, but I think that was a sign from God saying, get rid of them clients because that's a whole nother video for a whole nother story because y'all, y'all prices determine the clientele that you're going to attract. And let's just say I was lowballing myself in the beginning and that I wasn't giving it my all. I was giving it my all as, as far as running it, but as far as like the people that was the clients, um, yeah, like, like I said, that's a story time for another time. But anyways, um, so some things that did come true, like I just said, the clients in 2020, um, I wrote down here, buy a house in 2020. Y'all, that did not happen. I'm hoping to buy a house next year. I'm actually glad that it waited. That's what I say about God because God knew what he was doing because 2020, I didn't have the money. My credit score is still kind of messed up. But going into 2021, I'm definitely getting ready to buy that house. I'm also a first time home buyer. So that is going to be even great. It's an unfortunate for some people, but me going into 2020, already preparing my mind in advance beforehand when, when I was going through 2019 that kind of prepared me for 2020 because you know like i said i was getting ready to buy that house another thing on here that i had wrote down was um losing weight that ain't happened still working on that one um help 10 people get a job that was my goal in 2020 that didn't happen maybe like one person but i don't think i helped 10 people uh, travel the world with my family in 2020. That didn't help happen, obviously, because 2020, we couldn't go anywhere. I was trying to go to Mexico for my birthday trip, but that got canceled due to COVID when they started shutting down everything. Also, what I had planned for 2020 was opening my in-home childcare business. But like I said, I didn't buy the house, so that didn't happen. Let's see, something else. Um buying my motorcycle either a jigs or a cbr in 2020 that didn't happen but i did meet some great friends who offered to build my bike for me so like i said making a list is great but like i said everything's going to come at an appointed time i am mess manifesting everything that i want on my list i will continue to add on to my list I have over 100 things on this list. Like I said, the lines that are in black, those are the things that I already have scratched off the list. Now, some people, they do a vision board, but I tried to try something new this year by doing a list like Steve Harvey said because I didn't want to do a vision board this year. I wanted to try something different. So hopefully going into 2021, I can cross more things off my list and that i'll be able to add on more to my list but what i do to my list is i pray every morning i pray every night i manifest it and i just wait on god to just deliver everything that's going to happen on this list you guys so if you want to create a vision board please do so or like i said you can do the list and don't forget to like this video share it with somebody and also subscribe to the channel, guys. Bye. And also, if you like one of those cool t-shirts, I'm going to drop the link down in the description box.